we're here on a stem wall repair and what is going on is we have these rebar here uh, the overlap is causing the corrosion here so we we're chipping all of this out we cut the back one off we're going to be treating this with rust inhibitor epoxy and we tie it on uh, with our GFRP bar that's not going to corrode or rust on you and also we're installing this J-bolt removal and replacement of the J-bolt this is the new knife anchor uh, installation here and I want to talk about this vertical rebar here that the original concrete finishers put in the ground and then tie the rebar to it. That grounded it and is likely uh, one of the causes of the electrolysis in the steel and caused the corrosion, uh, pretty likely. And this J-bolt here, just for the folks who don't know what code is, if this thing comes loose, you have to remove and replace it. Uh, also, if it's corroded 20% or more of itself, which it is, uh, it needs to be removed and replaced. So what we do is we cut it off here, then we install the new uh, knife anchor as this one is just installed right there. It just screws right up to the top, a real easy install. And then this is the center plate anchor. Uh, we structurally screw that back up into the wood structure here. And these were the tension tie straps uh, that were in the front here. We're, we're replacing. Then there's also two J bolts that we're going to be replacing as well. So there's a lot of steel compacted in here on these stem walls. And, and if you don't correctly uh, manage this repair, it's going to come back. Uh, it's going to corrode some more. So for more information, go to concreterepairman.com. If you have any questions, please feel free to give me a call. My name is James Belleville. I'm the owner of Concrete Repairman LLC here in Phoenix, Arizona, 602-418-2970. Be sure to watch our videos on YouTube. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.